alone, a term mostly confused with loneliness. It's a state of solitude rather than the emotion. It's to be totally isolated from people, places, and things. Being alone can be looked at something bad or something unwanted. For me, a part is where my thoughts are the strongest. My creative bone is at its peak. Trees don't need other trees to grow. It just becomes. It will still take on carbon dioxide to give to us along with shade. I've been to many countries and places and noticed something people all have in common. We run from the idea of being alone. We as people have agreed on the idea of working hard and long, giving our time to loved ones or the people that are important to us. Being more selfless and less selfish. The root word of these two terms is self. The person we perceive to be when we look in the mirror. It's the way we distinguish ourselves from everyone else. Self is a single term, and to be single is to be alone. In this solitary place, things can get done. In arguments, it allows us to realize the part we played in the disagreement. When we're in a negative space, this place can tell us how to rule over emotions. The most important part of this place is that we can take a break and relax from the busy world around us. Peace is abundant here. And even though problems still may exist, optimism can be created. Whether you're around creative people or by yourself, your thoughts come to you alone. It's up to us to act on it. Let's change the perception of this and dig deep within so we can create and live in bliss. Being alone is not so bad.